Good morning everyone, so I have another really quick review video for you, but this time it's going to be about the new Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain. So as you can see, I have here 4 out of the 12 shades, so I'm going to swatch each of them for you and tell you what I think of them overall. So let's get started. So here on my hand, I have swatched all of the 4 colors that I own. The first one, this one right here, which is a hot pink shade, is shade number 25. Or sweetheart so that's this one the second shade that I swatched here is a lavender shade and this one is called darling or shade number 10 the third color that I have swatched is this which is obviously an orange and it is called rendezvous or shade number 40 and last but not least I have a cotton candy pink shade this one right here in this tube and it's called Cherish or shade number 15. So first of all, let's talk about the packaging. So it comes in this very convenient easy to use Stick form very similar to the Tarte Lip Surgeons and Clinique Chubby Sticks, which I do not own and In this little tube right here you get about 2.7 grams of product or 0 0.095 ounces of product and then you just take the top off and it looks like this so it's pointed so it's very easy to apply on your lips you can actually line your lips with this precisely and you don't have to worry about sharpening it because it twists up and down so you just twist this silver part right here now in terms of application as I said earlier because of how it's shaped it's very easy to put on the only thing is that it doesn't glide on very smoothly on your lips it kind of feels very solid very hard very dry but the color does come off on your lips when you apply it you just have to put like two to three coats or layers of it but I can't really say much about the color payoff and the pigmentation because I only own four of the shades and most of the shades that I own are more on the light side and I guess the most pigmented one that I own is this hot pink one called Sweetheart so it's the darkest shade that I own and even this orange color right here doesn't show up as much on one or two coats or layers so I have to kind of build it up up to three layers for it to really show up as an orange color and in terms of longevity I actually have it on right now I've worn this bomb stain I have the shade cherish the cotton candy pink one and I've had it on for about five hours now so when you first put it on it comes off really glossy but the longer you wear it it tends to be kind of drying on your lips so let me come closer you can kind of see the cracks on my lips now and it's not very moisturizing so it's totally different from the Revlon lip butters which are a lot more moisturizing and the color payoffs a lot better so with these the fresh uh, when you apply it fresh it does come on really nicely the color is very nice but the longer you wear it it does dry down and it does stay your lips so if you're not sure you want this color on your lips for hours just um, apply a balm on it because the color is kind of hard to remove or take off once it has dried on your lips so it takes about five minutes for the color to stain your lips and that color will be on your lips for the whole day about eight hours so let me just show you what it looks like freshly applied on the lips so since I have cherish on my lips I can't remember the names since I have cherish on my lips I'm gonna apply a fresh coat of cherish so you can see what it looks like when it's freshly applied so that's about two to three coats of cherish and as you can see, it is quite pigmented. The cotton candy pink color is there on my lips, but like I said earlier, the longer you wear it, it will be drying on your lips and it will stain your lips and your natural lip color will tend to show up more the longer you wear it or throughout the day, as you have seen earlier in the video before I reapplied. So it is really pretty, right? Oh, and before I forget to mention, these balm stains do have a minty smell, minty taste, minty feel to the lips. So if you're a big fan of mint, then you will definitely enjoy this balm stain. And I am a big fan of mint, so I really like the taste, the smell, and how it feels on my lips. It's not very tingly. It doesn't give you that plumping, tingly sensation, but it does have that minty feel. You know what I'm saying? Here's Coco. She's playing with Pepper. Pepper's chasing her, so I just wanted to save her from Pepper. Hey, everybody. I'm a sweet little Coco pudding. <laughs> see, look at her new color. I don't know if you can see it. It's baby pink, and it has cupcakes on it. And she has a fish 
tag here that says Coco. Oh, look how loving this kitty is. I so love her. But yeah, here's the swatches again. The darkest hot pink one is called Sweetheart. The one right next to it, a lavender shade is called Darling. The orange shade is called Rendezvous. And the cotton candy pink shade, the last swatch, and the color on my lips is called Cherish. So that was my quick review on the new Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stains. I got these from Rite Aid and they retail there for about $8. But of course, the price will depend on the drugstore and your location. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. If you have any questions, just post a comment below. And if you have your own experiences on these products or if you have other shades that you think would fit nicely, just post a comment below as well. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you again soon. Bye!